Now let me explain the APF modules for managing parameter sets, jobs, and archive functions in Cmatic PCS7. The parameter management module is used for central management of parameter sets for flexible production. The parameters can be either lists of feed materials with set point values or plant control parameters such as mixing time. Each parameter set can contain up to 100 parameters. Different parameter set groups can be created for different sequential control systems or plant units. Material parameters can contain a reference to a quantity to be produced by norm amount. In the APF engineering tool, it is defined for each parameter whether the parameter is normalized or not. The job management module provides a function block and a faceplate for planning and controlling jobs for each plant unit. It is possible to create up to 10 jobs and to start, stop or interrupt an active job for each plant unit. The batch name and batch ID can be assigned automatically with a logic function in the automation system or they can be assigned by the user itself. You select the desired parameter set when you create the job. These parameters can also be adapted on the control level, and they can also be documented accordingly. If the list contains several planned jobs, you can rearrange their sequence. The process control is executed by an SFC step sequence, or a user-written block. The corresponding parameter set data for the active job is available in a defined location in the automation system. Production data can be stored with the help of the archive management module. Data such as the set points and actual values of dosing and material transfer operations can thus be archived. Archive groups that have different data record layouts can be defined in the APF engineering tool. The data records of each archive group can consist of up to 100 values. The archive management module provides methods for automatically exporting or deleting data during runtime, among other things. In addition to displaying the archived data records on the operator station, these records can also be added to project-specific reports.